In this mod review, we're going to take a look at the Mercedes 190E car mod for American Truck Simulator. Oh, shit. Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today I thought we'd take a look at a car mod. Now it's been a while but we generally, when we're voting, you know we're doing the uh, best of weekly drive at the moment. Uh, when we're voting we generally have a look at some cars and stuff like that. So you know, because there are cars in, in American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck Simulator. So um, I thought I'd take a look at the at this one here, the Mercedes 190E. And you can get this one from the Kenworth dealership. Uh, and I'm the at the uh, Kenworth dealer in Elko. So there we go. Uh, let's jump into customized configuration and see what you can do. Well, first of all, there is one cabin. Well, you'd only expect one cabin, wouldn't you? Uh, chassis. Uh, there's two chassis for some reason. There's a, I think that's optional. I think that is in, in standard. I don't know why the standard is 30,000 and the optional one's 15,000. Everyone would go for the optional one, wouldn't they? But optional chassis? What does that give you an extra bit of... Oh, I know what it does. It give, Does it give you tramp rods on the back? No, it doesn't. Okay, alright, so no, that's, that's fine. Alright, now uh, engines. You've got a 2.5 litre diesel. Ooh. Or a 2 litre petrol. Uh, look, I'm going to have to go with the petrol on this one. Definitely. Uh, and then for the transmissions, only one transmission, 5 speed. And then we go over to the interior. Now, a um, couple of things I've noticed in here. It's Look, it's not bad. I mean, it does take a lot of work to do modding, guys. So, uh, I try not to be too harsh on them. Um... You know, even though sometimes it looks... Yeah, but anyway. Um, look, there's a little hole down the bottom there. I know, look, rodents and mice and shit like that can crawl in through there, make a nest in your, in your car, and that would really tick you off. When you're driving around a corner really fast and a whole heap of mice, you know, come scurrying out and all over your seat and you're going, oh, 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 oh my God, oh, oh, jeez. And then just, you know, you'd, you'd end up having an accident. So, no, you can't have that. You can't have a big hole in the side there that just doesn't work okay so uh, get some uh, I'd have to get some uh, a new door or, or some you know spack filler or something like that just to jam in there something the rats couldn't eat anyway um, but other than that look it looks quite good I don't mind it at all don't know what happened on the back there but anyway we'll just ignore that over the yeah on the back there as well it's a problem there as well, but don't worry about it. Just ignore it. It's all good. It's all good. Uh, paint jobs. Now, um, I did have a bit of problems with the paint jobs. However, I think I'm going to quickly try something. Now, I've noticed that with the accessories for this, that when you first select them, they don't work. Okay? But when you go to your wheels and you play around with these everything starts to work so that's weird I think that's really weird now I'm wondering will the paint jobs do yeah see the paint jobs now work see look at that that's amazing I have never ever ever seen that problem in my entire life ever but uh, and uh, to be honest I have no idea how you would fix that uh, so you can go down here there's heaps of different colors you can choose uh, there is a metallic. Let's check to see if the metallic's working. There is one. Uh, there is two. And are we up? Oh, there we go. There's perfect spot. Oh, look, there's three. Very good. Oh, look at that. Very nice. Uh, you can also go pilot car or police car. Not that it really looks like a pilot car or a police car, but anyway. Uh, you've got those options there. Pretend. Just pretend, all right? Just just pretend. Um, look, I'm I'm liking... I'm just going to go custom color here. And I'm going to go... Uh, it looks like some dodgy wrap there, doesn't it? I'm going to do that one there. It looks like a dodgy wrap, but I'm going to do it. There you go. Make a whole heap of people spew right now. 
Um, now, look, uh, let's fix these reels up here. Look, I, I like these massive big rims, these truck rims on there. I think that looks cool. But you can uh, fix those up, and there's a heap to choose from here for your tires. Um, and look, there's plenty. There's even those old school type ones. I think they're the original ones, aren't they? Pretty sure they are. And there you go. There's a whole heap of them. I'm going to go the original ones now look at this as well you can also have white walls white wall tires you don't see them much anymore you really don't oh that's awesome um so i'm gonna chuck some white walls on this as well um man wouldn't it be awesome if you could have rims and tires coming out that far be like massive dragway tires wouldn't it be awesome um drifting no 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 Ah, there we go. Look at that. Uh, now, for the nuts and that, it automatically selects everything that you need. Now, no, don't don't bother with a cover because it won't let you put it on there. Okay, so I can't even get rid of that now. So I'm going to just go back to here and see if that fixes it. Yep, and that got rid of the cover there. There we go. Right now, back to the other accessories. Now, the other accessories will work. There we go, see? Never seen a bug like that before, ever. Ever, ever, ever. Now that there is, I don't know. Uh, blue LEDs. Oh, that's blue LEDs underneath. There we go. Uh, do they work in here? No, they don't. All right, well, we'll try them later. We'll put blue LEDs on. Uh, there's your uh, lights, different lights. I do not like those. I think they look ugly as hell. At least those ones look, you know, they fill out the body a bit more and look a bit better. Uh, number plate, co-driver's plate. Uh, then we have mirrors, which they're just standard. Uh, that, I don't know, that's uh, tint. There you go, you different kinds of tint. So you can take that out, add a little gloss on there, or heaps of tint. Let's just chuck heaps of tint in there, it looks cool. Be like a drug dealer car with a bad rap. There you go. Uh, on the top there is some lights. You can add some police lights, whatever lights, blah, blah, blah. But for some reason, they get stuck inside the car, so... Uh, I'm going to take them out. Don't like them. Don't like them. Uh, on the side... Oh, that's the bumper. That's the bumper on the back. If you want to have a... Oh, that's already got a pre-dent. Somebody smashed in the ass of that. There we go. That's a bit better. Dented bumper or... Yeah. No, I think I'd much rather the standard bumper, not dented bumper. Screw that. Uh, then we go over to the spoiler. Only one spoiler, unfortunately. I was hoping for a massive big GT wing on the back. So people can see how big, you know, you, you think your penis is or whatever it is. I don't know. What, what do they put the big spoilers on there for? It's not aerodynamics. It just looks good. I don't know. It, it just looks cool, I reckon. So there you go. But this one's got this little flap there. So if you like a little bit of flap on your car, then there you go. There's your flap. Bit of flap there. I wonder if it actually flaps in the wind or if it just stays straight. So, you know aerodynamics just go straight over it don't know anyway uh let's go keep keep on going and we go over to the mirror on the inside and we've got the mirrors there we've got the driver's plate uh there's a mercedes emblem can't stain it uh, can't stain you can't stain the steering wheel you can't change the steering wheel is what i was trying to say i uh, you can if you have the accessory pack put on uh you know your accessory put on the hula hula girl there co-driver's plate uh, that is the, uh, uh, yeah, what's that? That's, I don't know what that is. Can't remember. Anyway, uh, then we got a little hangy dangly doodly thing. Uh, I've got to put dice in there. One. Wee, look at that. I've never seen that up so close before. That's pretty fluffy, isn't it? Did they make that more fluffier? That looks fluffier than what it used to. Looks good, actually. I like that now. Uh, then there's the main mirrors there. And that is it. Just don't look back over there, all right? Just don't, don't do it. Don't, shh. Don't look over there, okay? All right, let's go. Confirm there. And then we go uh, trade in. Trade in on the last mod. Yes, thank you. I had to think about that for a second. Yes, trade in. And okay. There we go. And it, it, it's loading. It's getting there. And where's the car? It's gone. Is it? No, there it is. Just so small. Oh, look at that. Doesn't that look repulsive? Wouldn't you spew if this car rolled up right next to you? 
you would just chuck up all over the place. There'd be chunder from breakfast time to evening to dinner time. It'd just be, look, look at that. That colour just makes me sick. It really does. It's disgusting. It's all right. <laughs> it's going to stand out, that's for sure. All right, now we've got the track IR here. Let me just fix that. It always glitches on me. Um, uh, fix, there we go. All right. Okay, now let's jump on the outside. Look, it doesn't look too bad, really. For a car mod, I think that's a pretty damn good effort. I, I think so, anyway. I mean, yeah, it's not... It's not perfect, but, you know, I've seen the shitloads worse. I really have. All right, let's turn the uh, ignition on. Sounds like the diesel. That's the diesel. Didn't I, I asked for? Wow. I'm going to go check the diesel. Diesel engine. There's the lights. Uh, we got high beams. Yeah, they're working. Okay, flashes. Yeah, we got to have indicators. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brake lights. Yep, reverse. Yep, there's reverse lights. Wipers. Oh, wipers. Are they going to work? No wipers. We don't have any wipers. They seem to have vanished. We've parked in a bad neighborhood again, kids. Somebody's stolen our, our windscreen wipers. Bloody hoons. We only just bought this thing and some hoon stolen our bloody windshield wipers. Damn it. Bloody kids these days. Oh, look, there's wipers. They're working in here. What's that? One big flappy wiper. Oh, that's ugly. Oh, well. Um, get rid of that. Oh, it's flapping more. It's going to fly away. Uh, display. Cross your fingers. Oh, it didn't crash. Amazing. Horn. Uh, air horn. No air horn. Right, okay. What else we got? Beacons? No beacons. No cruise. Drop axle? No. No. Alright, well, let's go check that other engine. I'm just, you know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to cut through there. It's alright. Alright, so that sounds to me like a diesel. Sounds weird. Anyway, uh, let's go check out. We'll go upgrade shop and I'll go back to here. I'm going to go... No, it was. It did flip over to the diesel. Right, okay. Okay, let's, let's try this engine now. There we go. That sounds like a two-litre petrol. Whoa! Sounds like a, it's got a lot of grunt in there. Oh, okay, let's let's go. So let's see, there's the gears there, two, three. Oops. Oh, oh, one, two. Oh, I've only got Oh. Jeez, one, two. Oh three th oh I see. It's only got three speed. What's oh oh there we go, right, okay. Sounds like a WRX. That does not sound like a Mercedes. Alright, I'm going to go on the highway with this. Whoops. Whoops, i got got to get used to the gears. Whoops. There we go. Oh, yeah, baby, we're off. And there we go, top speed. Come on, let's see how fast you can go. I wonder, can we? if we go up here really quick, can we jump it? Oh, yeah! <laughs> ah, no! <laughs> Shit. Oh, man, we jumped it, yeah! Yeah, that's awesome. A lot of damage though, but engine malfunction. Yeah, okay, kids. So don't jump your car in American trucks, okay? It it really does stuff it up. Oh dear. All right. Well, uh, I'm gonna see if I can get this off the road somehow. Oh, there we go. Oops. 
Oh, oh, sorry. Okay. All right. Come on. Let's let's go for one more try. There we go. The gears are, are, are really difficult in this. Oh no, that's it. Oh, I do have high uh, top gear. There we go. Shoulder driving. Awesome shoulder driving. Wow, I just realized how loud that engine was. That engine was like so loud. Sorry about that, guys. It, it, it. It. All right, let's see how fast we go. 127, 130. Come on, 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 come on. Engine mouth. Oh! <laughs> I think I just killed it. Oh no! I just killed my car. Oh, it's upside down. It's dead. That's it. Game over, pal. Game over. Game over, man. All right. Um, well, look, guys, that is the Mercedes 190, I believe, 190E, whatever it is. And it's upside down. So there we go. That's a perfect junior senior gaming car mod test. There we go. It's actually not bad. It was a lot of fun. Um, if you want to download this, in the description is the actual mod and uh, you can uh, have a whole heap of fun with it. I mean, that was that was something different. It would actually be really good for exploring this sort of car. But, you know, so there you go. If you love exploring, use this. Yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, that is pretty much it for me today. Look, if you like this video, then don't forget to punch that like button in the ass. And if this is the first time you've seen Junior Senior Gaming, then make sure you head on over to the Junior Senior Gaming channel on YouTube and check it out. And while you're there, why don't you hit that subscribe button? But until next time, don't forget to keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down, and I'm 1010 on the side. And remember, game on! Awesome, got it prepared. Right. Oh, shit! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> just leave those cars alone, alright? Just, just leave them alone. Oh, shit. He's just crashing into everything today. Come on, get out of my road. <laughs>